brutally murdered here in Bedford County. His name was Raymond Wood, and I know that everyone in the audience here this evening and at home has the Wood family in our thoughts and our prayers. The fact is, Ralph Northam and Tom Perriello, running on the Democratic side, support the establishment of sanctuary cities in the Commonwealth of Virginia. Ralph Northam voted to allow for that, and we cannot have that. That will not make us safer in the Commonwealth of Virginia. They both support issuing driver's licenses, state legal identification to people who are here in the Commonwealth illegally, and at the same time they support repealing our common sense voter ID laws that help protect the integrity of our voting system for legal citizens. And they support the discounted in-state tuition for the children illegally here and of illegal aliens. I understand those children are here by no choice of their own, but we need to make sure that those who are here legally get those in, that in-state tuition and are first in line at our great public colleges and universities. All right, Mr. Rebuttal. Yes. Ahead. This, let's take this moment to let you know you have one rebuttal left, Mr. Wagner two, and Mr. Gillespie two. All right, I'll take one of his. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead. It's funny, you know, in front of a, um, a Republican crowd here, Ed says one thing. But when he's in front of a general election, as he was in 2014, he was saying a totally different thing. And when he gets in front of the press and they're giving him a little pressure, he says a completely different thing. As he did in front of the, in, in front of the Larry Kudlow show at CNBC, when he supported the amnesty for 12 million illegal aliens. As he was supporting amnesty, I was deporting criminal illegal aliens and taking the grief for it. And I'm proud to do it because it's my number one job all is right. to protect all of you. Thank you, Mr. Uh, one of my yes, okay. Mr. Gillespie. Again, edforvirginia.com forward slash facts and Google Corey Stewart lies. The fact is that my record on this has been consistent in the 2004 Senate campaign. There was actually one of those PolitiFact check, fact checks. They do not tend to help out Republicans, as you may know. And they said that my record has been consistent. In fact, they cited an op-ed that I wrote in 2006, uh, actually opposing President Bush and his proposal to allow for citizenship for people who are here illegally. I have always opposed amnesty. I made that clear in my Senate run. I'm making it clear in my governor's campaign as well. Thank you. Mr. Wagner, you want to